firefighters say the home is a total loss. Atkins is on tour, but his children were at the home. Welcome back, everyone. Today, we'll be taking a look at country superstar Trace Adkins Homes. This singing cowboy has had some mega impressive houses over the years that we're gonna tour from top to bottom. I'm talking about everything from his new home to his country retreat. Born on January 13, 1962 and raised in Louisiana, Trace Adkins discovered his passion for music at an early age. He sang gospel music with his family and learned to play the guitar. But over the next two decades, Trace then established himself as one of country music's biggest stars with over 10 albums and a string of chart-topping hits. We're talking bops like This Ain't No Thinkin' Thing, Ladies Love Country Boys, and of course, Honky Tonk but Donk Donk. Trace has been inducted into the Grand Ole Opry and his awards include Billboard's Top Male New Artist, the ECM for Top New Male Vocalist, and American Country Awards for a few different things. Aside from his booming music career, Trace even appeared in TV shows and movies like King of the Hill, The Lincoln Lawyer, and Deepwater Horizon. Most recently, he starred in the drama series Monarch. Trace's larger-than-life personality, signature baritone vocals, and undeniable charm have made him a beloved icon in country music and beyond. Now that we've gotten to know the man behind that cowboy hat a bit better, let's mosey on over and explore some of the amazing homes Trace has lived in. From secluded retreats to Hollywood Hills mansions, Trace definitely knows how to live in country music luxury. First, we'll saddle up and take a look at the bachelor pad Trace used to call home in Brentwood, Tennessee. Located just outside Nashville, Brentwood is one of the most exclusive burbs in Tennessee, with a median home price around $500,000. But this posh neighborhood is a hot spot for plenty of celebs and athletes looking for privacy in a peaceful paradise. Trace's former Brentwood home was built in 2014 and spanned over 4,000 square feet with six bedrooms and five bathrooms. It's out on almost half an acre of land, so there was plenty of room for Trace to get his cowboy kicks in. This two-story brick beauty also had a walk-in closet in each bedroom, so he had space for all his stylish cowboy couture. Trace's stunning property featured a patio out back, perfect for him to host his famous summer barbecues. Inside, there was a home theater in the basement, where I bet Trace had many movie marathons with his family. I mean, with that silky voice of his, Trace was probably born to narrate movies too. One of my favorite features here had to be the beautiful view of the trees from the upstairs deck. This picture-perfect property was valued around $1.6 million, which makes complete sense for a celebrity home of this caliber. Sadly, Trace no longer lives in this Brentwood estate because it was destroyed in a major fire back in 2011. Reports say the fire started from some faulty electrical in the garage and spread quickly throughout the home. Luckily, Trace's family got out safely, but the house, well, not so much. What a nightmare. It just goes to show even celebrities aren't immune to tragedies like house fires. Well, after that devastating blaze, Trace and his family decided that it was time for them to rebuild and make new memories. Let's take a look at the fabulous estate Trace now calls home. Even though losing his precious Brentwood home was totally traumatic, Trace picked himself up and dusted off his cowboy boots to build an even more amazing estate in the same neighborhood. Trace's new Nashville home is another brick beauty that spans around 4,000 square feet. This pad has all the trimmings Trace needs to live his best cowboy life. We're talking six cozy bedrooms, five bathrooms decked out in the finest marble, and even a recording studio where Trace can lay down tracks and channel his musical muse. Of course, the home theater made a comeback in the basement because Trace needs room to watch his favorite westerns in cinema style surround sound. Trace made sure to include the little luxuries that make a house feel like home like walk-in closets, a spacious patio, and a three-car garage. And what about this adorable neighborhood? Just like his previous crib, Trace chose to rebuild in Brentwood's exclusive suburbs. 
can you blame him? We're talking manicured lawns, white picket fences, and homes so beautiful they look like they popped out of a magazine spread. Teresa's Place features lush professional landscaping with flowers and shrubs surrounding the property. Out back, Trace can host epic pool parties and barbecues in the spacious yard. Inside, sunlight drenches each room thanks to huge windows that highlight the breathtaking views. In the morning, Trace can take his coffee out on the upper balcony and look out at all the trees surrounding his estate. At night, Trace can cozy up by one of the home's multiple marble fireplaces and relax. However, Trace chooses to enjoy it, his new Nashville residence is the ultimate celebrity dream home. When Trace wants to get off the grid and enjoy a slower pace of country living, he heads to his secluded rural retreat outside Nashville. After years of searching, Trace finally found his perfect slice of heaven right on an old dairy farm. Trace and his wife Rhonda transformed this worn down farm into a beautiful countryside oasis that reminds Trace of his childhood. Nestled among rolling green hills, his rustic cabin getaway gives him the perfect space to relax, recharge, and get back to his roots. Trace's countryside cabin is all about bringing the outdoors in. Florida ceiling windows flood the home with natural light, offering panoramic views of the wilderness. You might even spot deer, turkey, or other wildlife roaming outside. The interior features gorgeous reclaimed wood that adds warmth and charm to the home. Trace made sure to incorporate natural textures and materials like stone, wood beams, and rustic metal accents that feel earthy yet elegant. Of course, music central to Trace's world, so his country retreat features an amazing recording studio where he can lay down new tracks surrounded by nature's melodies. There's also a cozy screened in porch that acts like an outdoor living room. Trees can jam on his guitar or curl up with a good book in one of the comfy wicker rocking chairs. When Trace is craving some good old fashioned southern barbecue, he fires up the custom built outdoor kitchen and grill. We're talking a full outdoor island with a cooktop, bar seating, and everything needed to host an epic country cookout. Trace can whip up his signature ribs and cornbread while guests sip sweet tea and to step to acoustic guitar on the fire pit. The surrounding countryside offers endless opportunities to hop on the quad and go off-roading. Or Trace can saddle up his horse and go for a trail ride under the stars. At the end of the day, an outdoor shower lets one rinse off before settling into the cozy master suite, which has its own stone fireplace and massive walk-in closet. From the natural wood finishing to the comfy covered porches, this retreat is Trace's perfect escape from the city's bright lights. The country charm reminds Trace of simpler times and lets his creative side flourish. We all need a peaceful place to recharge and Trace certainly found his. Now that we looked at three of Trace Adkins' homes, that wraps up today's video. But before we go, answer this question for me. What would be the best part about having a cabin in the woods or country vacation retreat and why? Let me know your thoughts in the comments and don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel. I'm Kara the Vampire Slayer, follow me on Instagram to chat and I'll see you all next time. Bye! Hey everyone, it's Kara or Kara the Vampire Slayer as you might know me and given my love for all things house and home, I recently wanted to get more hands on myself and I started tackling DIY projects at my own house. Being a new homeowner, there are plenty of unexpected things to fix and it's cool to learn what you're doing and hopefully be able to fix it yourself. There are also plenty of DIY projects suitable for beginners like me to do and ones that improve the look of your space drastically. Follow me and I'll teach you what I'm learning and motivate you to join me. You can DIY on a budget even if you're a total beginner. Follow me on Fix It with Kara and we can chat.